everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Deus Ex Revision with your host, Circuit Cultist here. When last we left off, we had just finished talking to... office. We just finished talking to our dear brother Paul here. We rescued Gunther Herman, talked to the resistance leader of this island. And so far we did everything by only killing people in the non-lethal way. With lots and lots of NyQuil. So, now, we are going to explore our home base. Way to go, sir. I thought Gunther was a goner. Thank you, Sergeant Bob. What does this say? Okay, that's just talking about the, uh, helipad code. You know what? We've, we've got a lot of those stuff we don't really need here. Like knives. Or a crowbar. We don't need crowbars for now. Let's see. Prod charger... <sighs> I want to say we'll never use the prod charger, but I don't want to kick myself in the foot, so we're going to keep it. I mean, at the very least, it's situational. Check in with Manderley on level two. Okay. And loading screen. Completely forgot my timer. Any minute now. Load times do feel slightly longer, but then again, I guess that's what happens when you update the game. Come on in. The retinal scanner can read blood vessel patterns right through your sunglasses. Really? That's sweet. Where's my job hat these? Before the briefing, you've got to go to level three for your equipment and a medical examination. See Jaime Ray is in the med center and Sam Carter in the armory. I always thought it was Jamie. <laughs> Let's see, is there anything here? Nope. Can I go in here? Yes. How are you doing, Bob? That's great. Let's see, is there any loot I can take? So, one thing some people might notice first is day. that this is a slightly different layout from the original game. Yeah. So, what I did get to this point here, but I never really thoroughly explored the base, so I have no idea where everything is, although by the looks of it, I'm guessing that leads to the uh, kitchen, which... But, or not the kitchen, but the break room, which is really weird because I distinctly remember that being on the first floor. Let's see, is there anything here? Don't mind me, Sergeant Bob. I'm just breaking two boxes, seeing what kind of loot I can find. Okay, well, I guess I found nothing. Your partner for the next assignment, Anna Navarra, is in the adjoining break room to the east. Maybe you should introduce yourself. Okay. Like, in the original game, this was just a really weird screen. Like, it was just a either a static or very twitchy image. That okay, well, it still sounds like it's not saying anything important, but at least it's at a uh, fluid motion now. Like that's actually pretty cool. Like it, it's this is really eerie because I'm so used to a static image. Like seeing a real model, man. Okay, there's, uh, Anna Navarra and Gunther Ehrman. I'll, uh, I won't talk to them just yet. Actually, no, that that's a lie. I'll, I'll go ahead and get that out of the way. Hello! Are you sure you pressed the right button? I do not make mistakes of that kind. Your hand might have slipped. No, I wanted orange. It gave me lemon lime. The machine would not make a mistake. It's the maintenance man. He knows I like orange. So you think the staff has some kind of plot? Yes, they do that on purpose. My new partner, J.C. Denton. Yep. Don't tell me you're going to wear those sunglasses during a night operation. 
My vision is augmented. At least it is a vase that we know when it's not foul. Forgive my interruption. Uh, I just also, I say don't have a beard. Working with you, Agent Navarra. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've got to be briefed by Mr. Manderley. I do not expect you to perform as well as Agent Herman, but the mission will require us to do more than frighten the NSF with our baggy coats that make us look bigger than we really are. I am prepared to perform my duties. He will not be the equivalent of his brother. I have seen that he knows the procedure of a good offensive. Let us hope you are right. I won't let you down, Agent. Shit. Yeah, Anna Navarra, not I the nicest person. I am not going person. to hold your hand. You have your orders. Yeah, not the nicest person in the world. Forget how Agent Navarra is not friendly. She has every life to give for our partner. I just love how Gunther just kind of confirms it. Ever so casually. You know, sometimes it, it's really weird looking at his model because sometimes I keep wanting to think he has hair, but he doesn't. It's metal. It's, he, he's got that, that Robocop sort of thing where his skin is like stretched over metal or something. Alright, let's see. What other places are here? Paul Denton's office. Complete with Buddha. Did he have a Buddha statue in the original? I don't know. <laughs> okay, from a distance, I thought his mustache was actually his face, so he was like doing this super extreme frown of disappointment. Kind of like a bulldog. Not sure who the other guy is. Let's see, what's the cube say? Hey, Manderly is yada yada yada. Okay, something about him operating out of New York. What is this place? I don't... Remember this... Hello? Hi! Office door key? Ooh, does that mean I get to open up the closet on the uh, bottom floor? They, in the uh, original game, there, there was this uh, one office you had to... Sort of, uh... I, 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 you, you pretty much had to lockpick it, and it was a total pain to try and get into. We'll finish the job when we get the Manhattan. Okay, is there anything useful in here? What's on this email? Let's go ahead and hack it. I mean, it could be important. Or not. Okay, so we have multi-tools. Always helps to break this. I think in the original you could find a lockpick or two. Or not. Well, that's disappointing. What does this newspaper say? Mm. Yeah, I'll let everybody else try and read that. Okay, let's go down to level... Got to cap some rebels, eh, Denton? I don't remember it being a spiral staircase either. Okay, so let's see. Joseph Manderley, JC Denton, yep, yep. Okay, this little bit's the same. Although the uh, break room I remember was down that way. Let's see. We have... Okay, well that didn't work. Let's see, which one? Okay, I think it was... Alright, that doesn't work. But I think it works for... No. this lead. Up some ladder. And oh! Okay, so that's where this leads. What's this? Wait, wh where am Gun range? What? It's a living. 
Wait. Go, sir. Gun range? We have a freaking gun range? So when did we get a gun range? Tank goggles never use them. Level two. We have a gun range. What? I can't wait to get to New York and finish the job. We. But uh, what? <laughs> Situation normal, sir. What? Wait. Oh, oh wait, wait, so, so I can, I can grab guns, H how do I grab, how do I... Gunther should have followed orders. Okay, no, seriously, how, how, how do I, wait, maybe, maybe that, uh, sergeant that was, uh, maybe the sergeant Bob that was standing up at the kiosk, maybe I gotta talk to him. Okay. I can't wait to get Can I totally use the gun range? The Please tell me I can. Way to go, sir. Situation normal, sir. Okay, I guess not. Alright. What if... Let's see, uh... Unico... Or no, 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 wait, it, it's, uh, SATCOM. And... Unico... Underscore zero zero one. Yeah. Are you... Oh, what? Way to go, sir. What? Okay, there's gotta be a button or something. I mean, y you don't, you don't do this to a guy. Y you don't, you don't throw all of this awesome stuff. Wait to get to New York. You know, like an actual gun credits, an actual gun range into the game that did not exist before, and just like throw a bunch of guns in front of me and be a total tease about it and say, ha ha, you can't do this. I mean, come on, man. I I'm like a certified, bona fide, super RoboCop guy thing. I should be able to. Is that liquor? No. Ooh, 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 ooh. Okay. Gun. Okay, so I I got that. Uh. What is this? Quarterman? Whoa! <laughs> I can't wait to get to New York and finish the job. General Carter, I read about the Mercedes uh, operation in school. Hey, Sarge. This is a great honor. Our general. I'm not a general anymore. Just call me Carter. I can't believe what the NSF did to your family. Enough of that, soldier. We each have our troubles. I lost my children, but you've had to grow up without your parents, which requires more courage. I don't think it matters. My parents died in a car accident. That's different. I said that's enough. You have your own op and time is short. How about I issue you a stealth pistol? That sounds fine. Thank you, sir. What else do you think you'll need? Let's see. Now... For these, uh... For these next few missions, we can ask this guy for stuff, provided we fit a certain criteria. Like, I think with the next mission, if we actually want to choose something, um, or get a bonus from him, we cannot kill people. At least in a certain part. Uh, yeah, with a battery park. So, let's see, what do we want? We don't want ammo just yet. We want, like, uh, either a lockpick or a tech tool, so, um, I'm thinking a lockpick would be more useful here. Yeah, let's go ahead and go with that. That's right. Infiltrate and evade. Engage only on your own terms. Now move out. Manderley's waiting. Yep, I'm sure he is. What? Where is... Where is this? I don't remember this place either. Uh, no idea. But it looks like some kind of interrogation room? What? Hang on, 
10, 0, 4, 5, 1. <laughs> oh, wow, okay, it's got five numbers. Hmm. What is this place? Is this the prison? Wait to get to New York. It's the prison! Yeah, okay, this this little extra bit here didn't exist. And yeah, I know I said I don't really use chargers that much, but it you know, never really hurts to have enough ammo for it. There's gotta be a way to get in there. What if I hack the uh consoles? Oh uh, well, we got more important things to worry about, actually. But that is a very, very unusual desk design. Let's see. Medical! This is where we want to go. Hey, everybody. That was a close Remember one. that blue canister we got? This thing? That's an augmentation canister. After we talk to our good friend, Jaime Reyes. Seriously, I could have sworn that at one point he says his name is Jamie. Hey, JC. You look like the real thing. They actually let you operate on people? Just fix Gunther's knee, in fact. A sticky actuator. So far, I feel more like a mechanic than a doctor. I'm impressed. They actually let you point a gun at people. We'll have to catch up later. I've got to leave for New York right away. I'm just realizing the text isn't all the way on screen. No That's problem. a little disconcerting. Listen, JC. About your augmentations. You know they're preparing to roll out the technology worldwide, right? As long as I don't turn green and grow a pair of antennas, as I understand it. Yeah, well, the design's pretty modular, which means you'll soon have access to upgrades from standard augmentation canisters. I think I picked one of those up at the top of the statue. Maybe you did. My order from Versalife was on the ship the NSF captured. You'll need to take it to one of the medbots for installation. I'll do that. The canisters contain a colloid of ROM modules. Some are generic upgrades, others require you to make permanent choices uh, about damn, how to just configure them your subsystems. It's about time they implemented some of this stuff. Report to Mander. He told me to send you back to him on the double. Uh, hang on right quick. Let me just take care of this. Okay. Yeah, so I've taken care of the, uh, Fraps issue, and... Okay, good, 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 and I also noticed my screen, for whatever reason, was getting a little crooked. I'm not entirely sure why. Med closet key, okay. Hey, is there anything else you gotta say? One more thing before I go, since you've been briefed on my augmentations. What can you tell me about the info link? Let's see, micro-receiver exostructure in the sulci, mechanocarbon threads on the axons. For queuing, you know, packet routing. Anything particularly interest you? Is there a way to turn it off? The info link? Yeah, or is someone at UNACO tuned in 24 hours? This might sound a little funny, JC, but I'm not permitted to answer that question. Your clearance is higher than mine? Regarding your systems, I am your physician. No big deal. I was just curious. Anything else? I wouldn't keep Manderley waiting if I were you. His nope. office is on level 2. Where's this go? Wait, what? Is that where I think it is? Jamie, do, do you know... Hi, me, ja Jamie, Mr. Rays, do you know where this leads? Because I do, and this was not in your office. I mean, it was kind of close. It was sort of like in a hallway back there or something, but yeah. Okay, well, anyway, let's go ahead and install this canister. So, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine different mods that we will acquire throughout the game. And every single one has a choice between two augments. In this case, we have the, uh, let's see, what is it, the arms? So, this is the muscle. Yeah, okay, so this one lets us pick up heavy objects like metal containers. This one lets us deal 
extra damage with melee weapons. Let's see. Yeah. So, honestly, there's a certain melee weapon we'll be getting in the game that is incredibly powerful and will render pretty much any melee investment kind of useless because of how powerful it is. So, we'll actually be using carry strength. And so, also, there will be some repeats of certain mods, and if you can look very closely, there's a dot here that represents the level that this augment is upgraded to. This is currently level 1, and I can upgrade it all the way to 4, provided I have the appropriate canisters. Now, I don't think there's enough canisters to max out all the augments. But we can still create a pretty balanced set, or a very, very powerful mod. And we will be saving up our first four canisters for a very, very powerful mod later in the game. And, let's see... Yeah, we won't be doing too much stat investment in this, though. So, we shall exit that, and speaking of skills... What are mine at? We have over 2,000. Okay, so... What we want... Oh, wow. Uh... Let's see. You know what? Always helps to have better, uh... Better computer skills. And... Bob really gets around. Throwing knife! Wow! That sounds incredibly useless. I say that. Well, then again, we don't really have any uh, investment in melee, so... Yeah, I guess it kind of would be useless, though. <laughs> I, I like how he just says Looks like you found me. I, I like how he just like in suddenly introduces this game like we weren't like in, in the original like you wouldn't even try to find this guy there was like no reason to it, he was just somebody you could talk to like leaving a mouse to cheese and this yet he still it, it's worry. like we, we were playing this game for like past five I'll minutes or something. I'm Alex Jacobson, communications Weirdo. engineer. I suppose you already know who I am. Getting there, you're certainly quicker on the uptake than your brother Paul ever was. Thanks. Anything to say? Don't worry, I'll be watching your back. Nope. You know, I always found it really, really weird, the uh, code for this door, or at least how I remember it. See, I got this game like Back in high school, when I was getting into Steam and stuff, It'll be interesting to see and uh, transmission sounds in I always figured this guy to be a Red Sox fan because I think that's one of his uh, passwords or something. So even though this game was made in like 2000, yeah, into in 2000, I keep remembering the password as being 2004. Wait, was it 2004? No, oh, well. Like, I, I keep thinking that his password is 2004 because he's like Red Sox fan or something. Let's see. And somewhere around, there we go. Okay, so nice to know they kept this in. Uh, I don't remember if those were already in there. Let's see, we got office door key, some stuff, soy, more soy, that's the only food we've been finding, like soy and candy bars, now something interesting is I saw this, it's behind here, 
the hell is that? Oh, it's a repair pot. I, I could use that. Let's see, so zero, four, five, one. What? One, one. Oh, wow. That, that's a very long password. Hey, buddy, what's the password? Online jukebox. We'll have to try that. All right, fine. Don't tell me. Okay, well, I'm actually going to leave. I I'm going... No, you know what? I'm going to do a two-parter for this one, because there's a lot of stuff to explore in this HQ. I don't like getting shot at. Not one so, yeah. I'm going to go ahead and, like, probably cut off the video here, but... Yeah, I I'm just going to upload a second episode today.